Hello, my name is Caitlin with West Palm Dog, and today I've got some help from my fellow trainer, Sasha, and we're here today with Duke, and we're gonna work on building up his recall again. Now, as I discussed last video, we're trying to fix Duke's recall back up to what it was before. So today we're working on distractions. So he's by himself today, and we've got him on a long line for safety, and I'm going to be using a squeaky toy and throwing it to distract Duke, and the goal today is that Sasha is going to be able to call Duke back from the toy no matter how interested he is in it. So just a start. Duke, come. Yes, that was really nice. You can see that Duke's attention immediately snapped up as soon as Sasha said his name. That's really nice. I'm gonna do that a couple more times. Duke, come. Yes, really nice. Duke even dropped the toy. And we're gonna do that a couple more times. For Duke, so what Sasha's gonna do, she's gonna shorten the line and try again. Yes. You see, that time she lured him away with some food, but she's gonna shorten how much leash she has with him. And we're gonna try that one more time. Duke! Come! Yes. Good job. Buddy. There we go. That was better. You see, even though Duke was just still distracted, Sasha was able to get a hold of his attention. Duke. Come. Yes. Nice. Now this is definitely something that we're going to keep working up towards. But you can see the toy is a big distraction for Duke. But we want to go ahead and, and make him as bulletproof as we can for yes. these recalls because it's one of the most important things you can teach a dog. Let's see if we can get one more from him. Duke. Sasha used the leash and her voice to learn back. Really nice job from Duke today.